house of Jacob, the house of Jacob, the fire, the fire of the house of Esau, who shall be a stuff, shall be a stuff. Um, let me ask you, if there was a white man yes. and he was a Muslim yes. and because the white man bows down with you and make prayer with you, yes. but the brother is not a Muslim, but yes. he is a believer in God, but he just don't believe in your way of God or your religion. He's yes. righteous. He takes care of his family. He feed his, um, he, he does work in the community. Even with that, does that still make the white man because he took his shahada and bowed down with you is he more your brother than the black man well you know like i said before you know i don't want to undermine the question and I don't right wanna, you know take away from it but i i love my brothers trust me brother mm -hmm. you know i come from the hip-hop era the self-destructive era the true real hip-hop era and i love my black people's you know what I'm saying? I make my money. I'm a merchant. I sell right. incense. I sell oils. I don't get no white customers. You know what mm. I'm saying? It's mind boggling. You know what I'm saying? And the fundamental principle of righteousness and who's superior and supreme in the law's eyes is not based on color or ethnicity or gender or sex. The one Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says in the Quran, in the Quran, the, 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 the most noble of you. And Allah's eyes is the most God-fearing, the one who fears Allah the most. You know what I'm saying? In Islam, there's prerequisites, there's principles. You know what I'm saying? And I try to stand upon them principles regardless. And this is what Malcolm died for. And so yes, right. the white man would be more of my brother. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. You know, uh, in regard in, in in their faith, but but no white man. You know what I'm saying? Because I I I I, I struggle with that every day. You know what I'm saying? Because I, 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 I've, I've struggled with that every day. No white man can take the biological bone of my bone, the flesh of my flesh, place of my brother. Now, when you say Allah, is that yeah. male or female? Or neither? It's, it's neither. No, okay. no. Allah is neither. We don't know Allah as a male or, or a female. We know Allah by his attributes, you know what I'm saying? Because he has many of them. He has eternal attributes. And the reason I ask, because they always say he. Yeah. God, you know, he don't like that. And I right. say, who you talking about? They say, oh, the almighty God. Nah, so nah. they always put that he on him. I say, well, almighty God. Nah, so nah. they always put that he on him. I say, well, damn, is it is it a male or what? Nah. We don't know Allah as a male. We don't know Allah as a male. No, we know Allah by his attributes, you know what I'm saying? Because he has many of them. He has eternal... Nah, so nah. they always put that he on him. I say, well, damn, is it is it a male or what? No, nah, he's not a male. No, nah, he's not a male. No, nah, he's not a male. No, nah, he's not a male because Allah is universal. He... You know, the Hebrews say the same thing, the Hebrew Israelites. Mm -hmm. They say they, they father already done, you know, showed them Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. Yeah. So which one is it? Is is God Yahweh or do y'all call him Allah? Because the Hebrews say Yah. Yeah, we, we identify. Yeah, how was Yah? Yeah, we identify. Well, you know, you know, because we identify. That's a double double question because the, the Hebrew Israelite realize they go by a, a Bible that has been defiled, that has been mm. molested, that has, oh. been, that has been, you know, raped. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Like you know, how could you follow a book that's not in its pure form? You mean to tell me the prophets? could see the end of time and didn't see the horror of the transatlantic slave trade and write about it? You mean the prophets could see and they didn't see America? And the wickedness of America? No, 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 don't look at me like I'm crazy now. If they saw this, and wrote about it, then they saw you in her midst. People, but why is it in the book? And then wallowing in the mud, like the Bible said, behold the dog returns to his vomit and the sow once clean to the muck.
I want to give all the praises and the honor to Yahweh Bahashem, Yahweh Shah Bahashem, Racha HaKwadash, and double honors to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone. Shalom to the elect. Peace to the elect. I want to go in this video here with uh, out of Sad Netter Studios. <laughs> you know, I just happen to, you know, I find these crazy videos and, uh, you know, what can you say, Jake? <laughs> you know, let Jake be taken, man. You know, there's nothing you can do for this Jake. But, you know, I just want to make a video out of it. I'm not going to go into the falseness of Islam, uh, the Roman Catholic doctrine, and uh, the cobblestone falling out of the, the, the atmosphere and Jake squabbling to bow down and worship it, dropping down to his knees, worshiping a heathenistic, religion and that's part of the curses when Yahweh shot well the most high said that we will follow other gods wood and stone christianity and islam okay that's what it is so you know i have not much to say on it i'll get a couple of scriptures but i wanted to go into the fact that this guy this jake this is what bothers me and i guess it shouldn't uh because these jakes were given up to be this way but these jakes you know the uh so-called muslim community they have all these pizza parlors they have all kinds of gas stations <laughs> they open up all kinds of businesses in the hood and this simple jake is on a bike with a pack of incense which nothing's wrong with hustling incense Nothing wrong with hustling oils, you know, but you should be doing it according to the community of your own. But these so-called Muslims, they own all these businesses and they'll hire the Mexicans, the Ishikarites, before they'll hire these black ass Jakes. So we can see through even Christianity and even through Islam Heathens have this way of persuading us to love all, love everybody in the fact, in the name of religion, right? While they continue to destroy you from under you. That's just what I notice. In the name of Allah, he claims he still loves the white man more than his own brother. But then he tried to twist it around the double minded man he is, tried to twist it around and said, My brother to the bone of my bone, flesh of my flesh. But he said through faith, he trusts in the white man more than his own so-called brother. What does that say? Unbelievable. Unbelievable. But this is sad Netta. <laughs> you know, he's, a, he's, he's, he's the author of confusion, okay? Ecclesiastes 10 and 13. The beginning of his words of his mouth, the beginning of the words of his mouth was foolishness. And the end of his talk is mischievous and madness. So this guy also goes on saying that asking about the, the, the Bible and is it watered down? And he claims it's watered down. It's not authentic. But yet there's not a prophecy that I even read or know of that's in the Quran. But the things that are in the Quran is watered down and taken from the Bible. Okay. All it is is a form of uh, they watered down the Hebrew, like most languages. But they've taken things from the Bible, watered it down, and dis dismissed prophecy. And they have the nerve to call him Prophet Muhammad. And Prophet means for to see or to say what's to come. But we don't see that in the Muhammad, I mean, in the uh, Quran. Meanwhile, this guy, Louis Farrakhan, he quotes scriptures out of the Bible all day. <laughs> So you t <laughs> you tell me these guys these guys ain't fools, man. Anyway, it's just confusing. <laughs> okay, this guy claims that God is not a male or female, but he said he his his he all day long. What the hell is wrong with Jake, man? This is why Jake is out pedaling on his bike, hustling uh, uh, incense, right? And even the gas, the Muslims in the gas stations. Got them beat out. They got the incense and hustling the oils while you get gas. 
How stupid can our people be? They're pressing right there in his face, oppressing him, foot on his neck. See, not only do we get the, the knee on our neck physically, we get the knee on our neck spiritually, man. Unbelievable. Genesis 17 to 17. Then Abraham fell upon his face, and they understand who Ishmael is. They know he's the progenitor of uh, the, uh, the the Muslims, Muslims, the so-called Arabs. Then Abraham, Abraham fell on his face and laughed and said in his heart, shall a child be born unto him that is an hundred years old? Shall Sarah that is 90 years old bear? Okay. And Abraham said, Abraham said unto God, oh, that Ishmael might live before thee. And God says, Sarah, thy wife shall bear thee a son. Indeed. Okay. Because uh, if you read the story, Abraham already had uh, um, Isaac and Ishmael. Okay. If I'm not mistaken, that was the story. And then she, uh, Sarah gave him Hagar. Okay. And now she wants a child. Okay. Anyway, and Abraham said unto God, Yahweh, Oh, that Ishmael might live before thee. And God said, Sarah, thy wife shall bear thee a son indeed. Okay, so the Most High had this planned all along, you know. It was all set up for Sarah to have that feeling. And more than likely, that's why the Most High allowed, okay, Hagar to bear uh, Abraham's uh, son, Ishmael, so Sarah can have that spirit on her to want to bear her son. Okay. And God said, uh, Sarah, thy wife shall bear thee a son indeed, and thou shalt call his name Isaac. And I will and I will establish establish my covenant with him for an everlasting covenant and with his seed after him. And as for Ishmael, I have heard thee. Behold, I have blessed him and will make him fruitful and will multiply him exceedingly. Twelve princes shall he beget and I will make him a great nation. But my covenant will I establish establish with Isaac, okay, which Sarah shall bear unto thee at this set time in the next year. And he left off taking with him, and Yahweh went up from Abraham, okay? So it's clear, There's, you know, uh, Ishmael had his blessing, okay? As Esau got his blessing now, okay? But the Lord said he would establish his covenant with the Israelites, okay? So, this jailhouse religion that this Muslim man must have had during his petty, thieving lifestyle, I don't know. I don't know what the man did. I don't want to talk, okay, and say that he did something that he didn't do. You know, I don't know. But they're more than likely this man picked this religion up from prison, okay? And he get they get reformed and they come out and they get a little bit of crumbs and they feel that they're successful. Okay, only our people can be beat down so bad. That's how you know we're the Israelites. We could be, be beat down so bad to a worthless form and still have some way of forming some form of love to our own enemies. And while our own enemies prosper using us and gaining advantage over us while we're continually being beat down, we will continually show more love to them than we would show to our own people. This is what we see with this 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 uh, young man, or I don't know, he's an old old head maybe, who has found, who has admittedly said he puts more faith in the white man than his own so-called brother who believes in God. Okay? So if we come up as an Israelite and we're not Muslims, he'll put more faith in the white man. Okay, this is what he said, Matthew 22 and 32. It says, I am the God of Abraham and the God of Isaac and the God of Jacob. Now, the, the Quran, the Quran even mentions the children of Israel. Okay, I believe in the book of Cal. They, I don't know. I am the God of Abraham and the God of Isaac and the God of Jacob. Okay. So. All the others are skipped over and, and the main, on the main scene, Ishmael is skipped over. Out of Isaac, you had Jacob and Esau is skipped over. God is not the God of the dead, but of the living. So this proves right here. What happened to Ishmael? What happened to Esau? Don't look like they fit the criteria. 
Anyway, I just wanted to touch on that. That's all I have on that Shalom.